Good morning, everybody. Good morning, Miss Demi. Good morning. We are doing a little something different today. We are um, currently headed out to uh, work on the boat. Yeah, that's right. We We're actually, going to my house. Yeah, we um, boat sitting in her house today. That's where we uh, broke it all down uh, a lot yesterday. We actually started this project yesterday. And uh, we worked on it probably about close to six hours. Uh, we had to get the Dremel tool and this and that and get some old bolts off and things like that. But we've stripped the seats off and pulled the trolling motor off and and the motor itself and um, this and that and rod holders and everything. We've stripped off this boat. Uh, we are totally cleaning her up and we're gonna give her a new paint job and uh, we got some new accessories for her and, and so on and so forth. New seats. We got some new seats. Uh, picked up a new fire extinguisher today because apparently my other one has a, a hole in it. Don't know how that happened. True, I don't really. And, uh, but uh, we are gonna turn this thing into something beautiful. That, <laughs> right that is the plan anyway so i hope you uh enjoy this process as we go through it of uh cleaning this thing up i went on and took a few pictures of her yesterday so we can have that good before and after look and uh, uh i'm excited i'm excited to see how it turns out what do you think it's gonna be beautiful it's gonna be gorgeous gorgeous so stick around for that and uh, as we go through this, like I said, we'll continue to take pictures. May do some videos on it as well uh, on part of this process. But if you've got a, if you've got a, that old John boat, for instance, sitting out there, uh, and you want to upgrade it, of course, some people turn John boats into bass boats, and you, there's videos out there for that and things like that as well. Of course, uh, we catch all kinds of fish out of this thing. Uh, mostly lately, obviously we're, uh, of course, PNT catfish. That kind of gives it away right there. We're, we're uh, doing a lot of catfishing uh, out of this boat, and we're going to do a whole lot. That's the plan, anyway, uh, this year uh, out of that boat. But we're going to beautify her first. We're going to do some crappie fishing soon. Yeah, we got to get back out and, and hit some crappie. It is that time of year as well. Uh, we were doing that last year uh, on this day, as a matter of fact. Uh, crappie fish day is um, Easter actually Sunday. Easter Sunday. And uh, thank you, Lord, for another beautiful day and uh, your sacrifice. But uh, continue to watch, and uh, uh, hopefully uh, we will get this thing done within the next several months. No, hopefully within... <laughs> Uh, Not that long. No, hopefully within the next day or two. Anyway, uh, she can be done and be back and ready for the water. Is getting cleaned out real good before going through the car wash for her last wash. We're getting all this dirt and grime out of there, and uh, then she'll be ready. Now that we've got uh, the last of it today stripped off, there we're going to pull the I think the uh, the lettering and uh, numbers and and. Uh, you know, tags off of it. Uh, of course, that's on both sides. We've got to do that. And, and uh, again, we get it vacuumed out, washed out, and this puppy's going to be ready to paint. And then we're going to start working on the trailer as well. Okay. I hope you guys can see this good. We've almost completely got uh, the first coat of paint on this boat and I'm gonna say she's looking pretty good 
she is looking so pretty so pretty but you can see this boat had been painted a few times before um, and uh, you've got blue on it and then you've got this kind of camouflage pattern they attempted to have on there at one time and uh, it uh, we're just painting it one beautiful solid color right now Tammy what's the name of that driftwood it's driftwood I think that's um, a reasonable name Are we naming the for boat the driftwood? paint on the boat oh yeah well we could do that what do you think folks uh, make a comment or like or something if uh, if you think we should name this boat driftwood sounds good also want to thank Christian Ochoa and Zachary Richards for helping us flip the boat onto these oh lines. yeah absolutely they came over to pick up my daughter and uh, they were it was good to have the extra help so we're gonna get back to finishing up this boat You just rinsed off the uh, trailer because she's gonna get a paint job too. Um, real quickly, rinsing her down and getting ready to paint her up. While we're at it, might as well do them. Do them both. Hey everybody, I said today we uh, were working on the boat and that we would be uh, painting it. We have spent the day, basically a whole day, uh, we finished stripping uh, one or two pieces off of it, washed the boat out, scraped the trailer clean, washed the trailer. We've been working. Very hard. All day. Very hard. <laughs> and, uh, but we're gonna give y'all a glimpse of this thing. Uh, we got the trailer. Uh, painted in black color I uh, hope you can see that the winch the new winch I bought uh, just the other day uh, is on there uh, look at the wood I don't know if the light is gonna let you see this the wood color on the boat it's the front of the boat look at this boat look how clean and pretty this uh, driftwood color is on the boat and then we've got this bench seat in the middle, this wood bench seat. And again, it's in that color and it's gorgeous. We've got to do, uh, we've got the guides uh, to the boat and uh, that's stained in that color in wood. Uh, and the contrast with the boat uh, and the trailer and uh, the guides on there look great. The back of the boat right here, the wood in the back. Uh, was, I'm not done yet. Yep. Still got to stain that one right there and uh, put the seats back in. Yep, that sucker is going to look nice. We've got brand new seats that are going in this. Um, probably going to try and clean the, uh, the, the winch pulleys up uh, and put them back on the boat possibly uh, for the anchors. Uh, and uh, obviously the uh, mount for the depth finder goes right up in here and uh, let's see then the rod holders oh let me put my hand in front of the camera that's very professional let me uh yes that's me all over uh then the rod holders that i recently got um the what are the drifting rod holders or something is the name anyway i said uh that i would uh let you guys know how i like those i like them i really like those rod holders uh, doing a great job for this boat uh, and again uh, the sun's on that side so I don't know if you see this well 
but that boat and trailer now looks amazing uh, compared to how it did um, just hours. hours ago. Yeah, definitely 48 hours ago, but even eight hours ago. Uh, it's like a totally different boat. We're still not done. we still got work to do. It's going to be a few days, uh, probably before everything gets back on the boat and she's ready for water. Uh, actually, you know, the numbers, stickers, license, all that still have to be uh, put back on the boat. It's that time of year to uh, basically get out there and get another one anyway. But I'm going to say we've worked hard on this thing uh, and it paid off. This boat looks good. And if you're somebody, you know, that just wants to get out there and, you know, have your boat look nice, you know, and, uh, and, and as well as, you know, you're helping to uh, waterproof your boat with a new paint job too a little bit. Uh, but you're also increasing the value in that thing uh, for if, you know, you're looking to turn around later on and sell that boat. Uh, this one, probably hang on to for a minute. Uh, looking to get another boat too, a bigger boat, obviously, for some bigger water, bigger fish. But uh, this puppy right here has done a fine job. And right now she looks almost new. So we're going to hang on to it for a bit. Again, we're still not done. Uh, with the transformation on this and we will show you more later hey guys so that's it for today all we're going to do today on this boat uh again it looks great again we will show you the finished project i don't know if we'll do a uh you know boat transformation to video uh or whatever but uh we will definitely show you how it looks uh, probably next time we go fishing uh that we might do a little bit uh about the boat uh prior to us going fishing but anyway she looks great proud of the work we did and uh we'll see y'all soon